Butyl rubber is a synthetic rubber, a copolymer of isobutylene with isoprene. The abbreviation IIR stands for isobutylene isoprene rubber, polyisobutylene, also known as PIB, or polyisobutan N, is the homopolymer of isobutylene, or 2-methyl-1-propene, on which butyl rubber is based. Butyl rubber is produced by polymerization of about 98% of isobutylene with about 2% of isoprene. Structurally, polyisobutylene resembles polypropylene, having two methyl groups substituted on every other carbon atom. Polyisobutylene is a colorless to light yellow viscoelastic material. It is generally odorless and tasteless, though it may exhibit a slight characteristic odor. Butyl rubber has excellent impermeability, and the long polyisobutylene segments of its polymer chains give it good flex properties. The formula for PIB is minus 2 N and the formula for IIR is, it can be made from the monem isobutylene or CH2 equal C2 only via cationic addition polymerization. A synthetic rubber, or elastomer, butyl rubber is impermeable to air and used in many applications requiring an airtight rubber. Polyisobutylene and butyl rubber are used in the manufacture of adhesives, agricultural chemicals, fiber optic compounds bull bladders, corks and sealants, cling film, electrical fluids, lubricants, paper and pulp, personal care products, pigment concentrates. For rubber and polymer modification, for protecting and sealing certain equipment for use in areas where chemical weapons are present, as a gasoline, diesel fuel additive, and even in chewing gum. The first major application of butyl rubber was tire inner tubes. This remains an important segment of its market even today. History Isobutylene was discovered by Michael Faraday in 1825. Polyisobutylene was first developed by the BASF unit of IG Farben in 1931 using a boron trifluoride catalyst at low temperatures and sold under the trade name Opinol BPIB remains a core business for BASF to this day. It was later developed into butyl rubber in 1937 by researchers William J. Sparks and Robert M. Thomas at Standard Oil of New Jersey's Linden N. J. Laboratory. Today, the majority of the global supply of butyl rubber is produced by just two companies, ExxonMobil, the successor to Standard Oil, and Polymer Corporation, a Canadian Federal Crown Corporation established in 1942 to produce artificial rubber to substitute for overseas supply cut off by World War II. It was renamed Polyzar in 1976 and the rubber component became a subsidiary, Polyzar Rubber Corp. The company was privatized in 1988 with its sale to Nova Corp which, in turn, sold Polyzar Rubber in 1990 to Bayerag of Germany. In 2005 Bayerag spun off chemical divisions, including most of the Sanyer site, creating LANXESS AG, also of Germany. PIB homopolymers of high molecular weight to polyolefin elastomers, tough extensible rubber-like materials over a wide temperature range with low density, 0.913 to 0.920, low permeability and excellent electrical properties. In the 1950s and 1960s, halogenated butyl rubber was developed in its chlorinated and brominated variants providing significantly higher curing rates and allowing co-vulcanization with other rubbers such as natural rubber and styrene butadiene rubber. Halobutyl is today the most important material for the inner linings of tubeless tires. In the spring of 2013 two incidents of PIB contamination in the English Channel, believed to be connected, were described as the worst UK marine pollution for decades, the RSPB estimated over 2,600 seabirds were killed by the chemical and hundreds more were rescued and decontaminated. Uses 
fuel in lubricant additive. Polyisobutylene can be reacted with maleic anhydride to make polyisobutyl succinic anhydride, which can then be converted into polyisobutyl succinamides by reacting it with various amines. These derivatives have interesting properties when used as an additive in lubricating oils and motor fuels. Polyisobutylene added in small amounts to the lubricating oils used in machining results in a significant reduction in the generation of oil mist, and thus reduces the operator's inhalation of oil mist. It is also used to clean up waterborne oil spills as part of the commercial product elastyl. When added to crude oil it increases the oil's viscoelasticity when pulled, causing the oil to resist breakup when it is vacuumed from the surface of the water. As a fuel additive, polyisobutylene has detergent properties. When added to diesel fuel, it resists fouling of fuel injectors, leading to reduced hydrocarbon and particulate emissions. It is blended with other detergents and additives to make a detergent package that is added to gasoline and diesel fuel to resist buildup of deposits and engine lock. Polyisobutylene is used in some formulations as a thickening agent. Explosives Polyisobutylene is often used by the explosives industry as a binding agent in plastic explosives such as C4. Polyisobutylene binder is used because it makes the explosive more insensitive to premature detonation as well as making it easier to handle and mold. Sporting equipment. Butyl rubber is used for the bladders in sporting balls to provide a tough, airtight inner compartment. Damp proofing and roof repair. Butyl rubber sealant is used for damp proofing, rubber roof repair and for maintenance of roof membranes. It is important to have the roof membrane fixed, as a lot of fixtures can considerably loosen it. Rubber roofing typically refers to a specific type of roofing materials that are made of ethylene propylene dean monomers. It is crucial to the integrity of such roofs to avoid using harsh abrasive materials materials and petroleum-based solvents for the maintenance. Polyester fabric laminated to butyl rubber binder provides a single-sided waterproof tape that can be used on metal, PVC and cement joints. It is used for repairing and waterproofing metal roofs. Gas masks and chemical agent protection. Butyl rubber is one of the most robust elastomers when subjected to chemical warfare agents and decontamination materials. It is a harder and less porous material than other elastomers, such as natural rubber silicone, but still has enough elasticity to form an airtight seal. While butyl rubber will break down when exposed to agents such as NH3 or certain solvents, it breaks down more slowly than compound elastomers. It is therefore used to create seals in gas masks and other protective clothing. Pharmaceutical stoppers. Butyl and bromobutyl rubber are commonly used for manufacturing rubber stoppers used for sealing medicine vials and bottles. Chewing gum. Most modern chewing gum uses food-grade butyl rubber as the central gum base, which contributes not only the gum's elasticity but an obstinate, sticky quality which has led some municipalities to propose taxation to cover costs of its removal. Tires butyl rubber and halogenated rubber are used for the inner liner that holds the air in the tire. 